Can red light therapy help our pets? You might be surprised, but yes, and I'll tell you all about it in under four minutes. <laughs> Meet my dog, Storm. She is one of the greatest loves of my life. And if you're like me, your pets are a part of the family. We live in Arizona and Storm is my everyday hiking partner. Despite being formally trained to avoid rattlesnakes, she got bit in the face by one that invaded our yard. Luckily, she got prompt medical attention and received anti-venom, but it did leave lasting nerve damage, which caused her legs to shake every time she squatted to go to the bathroom. I discovered red light therapy about a year after that incident and began treating her daily. Within two weeks, her shaking had noticeably diminished and within 30 days, it was completely gone. There have been over 5,000 studies showing efficacy in not only humans, but also in animals, including mice, hamsters, rats, rabbits, cows, ducks, hens, geese, horses, dogs, and even reptiles. I did my own research and saw that like people, there were little to no side effects and dogs and cats eyes are oblivious to red light. Red light therapy targets the mitochondria in the cells, which release ATP, adenosine triphosphate, which is the energy our bodies need to function, but which also heals and repairs cellular damage. This is done not only in the organs, tissue, and muscle, but is also systemically circulated throughout the blood. As an everyday mountain climber, I also began treating Storm's hind legs to help increase her muscle mass and reduce muscle soreness. Storm is almost 13 and is very active, but about a month ago, she suffered a stroke that affected her vision, hearing, and smell on the right side of her body. Within minutes of having the stroke, I treated her with red light therapy because I knew that one key advantage of red light therapy is that it interacts with a respiratory protein called cytochrome C oxidase found in all species and allowing it to use the oxygen better and also increasing blood flow by making the vessels more flexible, allowing an increase in oxygen throughout her body and to her brain. The vet did give her an IV as the only stroke treatment, which also helped increase oxygen to the brain. I began treating Storm with red light therapy five minutes, three times daily. And within three weeks, Storm has recovered about 95% of her function, and she's even back to hiking. I read that dogs have a fair chance of recovering from a stroke within three to six weeks. Your dog or cat's fur length may require longer treatments. I use a panel to make sure that there is enough power to deliver a therapeutic dose. Don't take my word for it. I will link several studies below in the show notes. Red light therapy applied to the bone marrow of a pig's leg after a full-blown heart attack, improved heart function and reduced scarring, which translates to humans and dogs. If you have an aging pet, red light therapy may be a great way for you to help heal your dog's joints, acute or chronic pain, arthritis, bone health, sprains and strains, skin issues, and pads. I want my girl to have a healthy, happy life as long as she can. So in addition to a good diet, exercise, and vitamins, I've added 10 minutes of red light therapy daily into our routine.